Back last year, about October, November, I found myself uh, staying really busy. I own an event planning and design company here in the Triangle. And uh, so constantly busy and going and helping other folks. And um, I did a wedding last September where a friend of mine was the photographer. And she, uh, at the end of the event, just kind of snapped a little picture of me and, and thought it'd be a nice little thing for me to have. Just uh, sent it to me. And I looked at the picture and I realized I was the heaviest I'd ever been in my life. Um, I had a career as a professional runway model for eight years uh, back in, in my younger years and just never really realized looking in the mirror every day that I had become this unhealthy. And it wasn't a choice to become skinny because I don't think skinny is always healthy. I wanted to be healthy. And by coming here and uh, with John and his staff, they were able to kind of help me redo my thinking on what healthy was and how I could look good and feel good again without comforting myself with food. When I realized I really wasn't that healthy and I was so overweight, um, I realized that I was missing out on a lot because I really only felt like sitting and eating. I didn't have energy, um, I didn't have drive. I mean, I was working and staying busy, which is great, but I wasn't doing anything for myself. And I was getting very stressed and I just could feel I wasn't myself. Um, when I made the decision to start working out at Move It Be Fit, my energy level changed, my whole attitude about life changed. It wasn't anymore just, um, okay, well, this is how I am. I mean, I remember going as a woman in my mid-40s, going to my doctor who told me, you are perimenopausal. This weight that you have, you will never lose, so don't try to lose it. And I took that at that moment as an excuse to eat anything and everything I wanted, to not move, to not exercise, to just be complacent in the fact that I couldn't change that. And it was when I saw this picture of myself that I actually brought today. And this was me at 191 pounds. And I just looked at it and I didn't know where that person came from. So it was really important for me to not be that size so that I could enjoy my children. We have four children and we have a three-year-old granddaughter. And we weren't able to really do a lot of things because grandma didn't feel like getting off the couch and she just wanted to sit and watch TV. And after I started working out, I just found this energy that I never knew I could have. And I found um, a motivation that I didn't know I could, I could ever have. And that transitioned into my family life and into my children's lives and into my granddaughter's life. So that now we are active and we do things together and we don't ever get complacent about where we are or what we're doing. I'll never forget the first week that I came for workouts and it was three times a week. My very first week, I just thought, oh my God, I'm going to die because it was just so intense. Um, but the really cool thing is I, I have health limitations physically as far as um, my whole left side is permanent damage from a, a two-story elevator fall back in 97. And I was able to explain that to my trainer um, who was handpicked for me and they knew exactly who to give me because I needed somebody that was really going to push me and not baby me and coddle me because I, that's not who I am. And I just remember I, I didn't think I was going to be able to do it. But to see where I started in doing my crunches and my lunges and um, everything else that we were doing here, to see how it started and then the next week how I was able to come in and you know, I could knock out those, those crunches like that and it was no big deal. And I'm just thinking, you know what? Look at you, you're getting stronger, you're getting healthier. And that's what I keep reiterating to everybody. It's not about being skinny, it's about being healthy. Now I've gone from someone who had constantly high cholesterol, high triglycerides. Now that I'm exercising, I don't have that problem anymore. Wow, if you are even thinking about getting a personal trainer, I highly recommend Move It Be Fit. They took me, who was someone who was very skeptical about exercise, hated a gym, never wanted to hear the E word ever in my vocabulary, and made me actually enjoy working out, which blows my mind because I never thought I would say that. 
Um, they made it enjoyable for me and it wasn't about being on a weight machine all the time and running laps and things like that. They taught me to use resistance bands and they taught me to use my body um, to help train itself and to do things that I just never thought you could do without being in a gym with all these bulky guys staring at you and women that were stick thin that you know you just felt really uncomfortable around and with this it's one-on-one -on -one. it's perfect for um, someone who's self-conscious as I was even it was hard for me to even dress my body to exercise when I started because I was so self-conscious and then after you know the first few times you become comfortable with your surroundings with your trainer they are there to help you one-on-one -on -one. that's your time and that's exactly what I needed to get me back into a mode and a frame of thinking that I can do this. It's not too hard for me. It's not out of reach for me. I can do this. And I would just encourage you, if you're even remotely considering it, give it a try. Because it's not like going to a gym. It's totally, totally opposite. And it will change your life. I promise you.